Aside from all that jazz, the 11th edition of the Montreal Fantasia Film Festival kicked off today. Natasha Gargiulo spoke to a local Montrealer who almost went broke so he could make his film come to life. Amanda, I'm at McLean's Pub on Peel, and for some, this is a place where you can enjoy a great pint with some friends, and for a filmmaker in Montreal and a director, it was a way of making Yellow Fellas a dream come true. The shots that we get in Yellow Fellas are simply because of this man. Stuart Ashton is usually seen managing McLean's Pub. Tetsuro Shigematsu is usually heard hosting a radio show or acting on TV. Together, these local Montrealers deliver Yellow Fellas to the big screen. I walked away from the six-figure income uh, in broadcasting simply because I knew that I had this film inside of me and it was burning a hole in my soul and if I didn't get it out, I was going to have an ulcer. Yellow Fellas is a feature-length comedy about an angry young Asian man who recruits a small army of Orientals in order to stick it to the white man. The concept stems from a conversation overheard while attending an Asian studies press conference. And I heard one particular phrase, yeah man, but where are we going to get the money for the guns. Remember, these are two Asian academics talking. I thought, okay, you guys are kidding, right? Talking about armed insurrection, you know, taking on Whitey. But apparently they were not. And I thought, you know, there's something here. And that was the genesis for Yellow Fellas. The subversive comedy shot entirely in Montreal had 100 extras on set and a budget of only five grand. Tetsuro says they manage with what they had. We don't have any permits. Yes, the Metro cops are, are running after us, but this is how all movies are made. And yes, it's completely normal to pull up chain link fences or climb over barbed wire or to get chased by police and nearly get arrested. The action flick that parodies race relations has already won some awards and will get its Canadian premiere at the fest. But you can go ahead and see the summer blockbusters, you know, but they're kind of like Chinese food. I mean, they leave you feeling empty five minutes later. And what's that? What's that? Oh, yeah. For more information, go to yellowfellas.com. Join the revolution. Yellow power. Don't drop the mic. How could you say no to that little irresistible girl named Mika? You can catch her, her dad, and her mom at the Canadian premiere of Yellow Fellas taking place on Saturday at 5 p.m., part of the Fantasia Film Festival.